Hey, it's Kyle here from Adelaide Vehicle Centre. I just thought I'd do a quick video of our Toyota Land Cruiser before it goes to the detailer, just due to the amount of interest we've had in it. Um, so it's a 2010, it's done 292,000 Ks. Um, it's overall in really, really good condition with a couple of really good features as well. So I'll just touch on that on the interior. We'll start on the interior first. Um, so I really just want to touch on the features and condition of it. Starting off, we've got cruise control fitted to this one, as, uh, which is super duper handy. They don't usually have that in the workmate at all. Um, really good for that long distance driving. To the right, you can see we've got a variety of switches for the spotlights and um, LED light bars that are fitted to this vehicle as well. Idle up switch here as well, good for keeping the, the idle up during hot days or cold days. You want to get the heater or the aircon going a little bit quicker. Um, over here, you'll see they've fitted a aftermarket head units to the vehicle as well so all touch screen you've got your usb and auxiliary inputs through there as well cd is still at the top there um, so pretty handy thing to have in in this vehicle as well just down from here we've got your aircon controls so i believe aircon is actually an option in this vehicle um, it has been option to the vehicle it's very very cold you've got your sub sub uh, fuel tank there as well um, as you'll see, you can see that in the cluster, you've got your uh, normal fuel gauge and your sub fuel gauge there as well. You've got your four wheel drive selection down the bottom here. Pretty easy, straightforward to use. Um, down here, you'll see we've got a 12 volt power outlet. Forgive us for it being a little bit dirty. The vehicle hasn't been detailed yet. Got a little compartment here for putting your belongings in, um, and you'll find the 12 volt power outlet is actually for this fridge here. So. Handy thing to have, doubles as an armrest. Again, it's not the cleanest thing, but um, yeah, chuck your food, chuck your drinks in there. Really good thing to have. We've got all the keys for the boxes and stuff that are on the back, they're just in here for the moment. You'll find we've actually got some leather or leather look seat covers on uh, both the drivers and passenger seats. Um, and just giving you an idea of sort of the condition of the dash on the vehicle here as well. Um, I'll jump out. Oh, worth mentioning there's actually a shelf someone's fitted up here as well the condition of the seat covers is very very good As I'm trying to show you the condition of the vehicle, worth mentioning, there's a little bit of a dent just here underneath the fuel filler. See, it's got the side skirts fitted to it. Got the toolbox back here, which we'll come to in a minute. Uh, your off-road tires here. So the Coopers, plenty of tread left in these. Come around, we've got ARB bull bar fitted. You've got LED side lights. You've got LED light bar. Um, and spotlights here as well, so plenty of setup going on at the front of this thing. Um, so coming to the engine bay, you'll see dual battery setup here. The V8 turbo diesel, plenty of power. Um, pretty heavy du duty power wiring running through the engine bay here. As you'll see, it's fitted with Anderson plugs uh, towards the rear of the vehicle. Um, an important thing for us at Adelaide Vehicle Centre is checking just stuff like bolt heads under the bonnet and along the guards make sure they haven't been tampered with in any manner that may resemble the vehicle having been in an accident we're actually the only dealer in sa that provide a full structural guarantee um, so we guarantee the vehicles haven't been in an accident where the structural integrity of the car is compromised just give more of an idea what it's like i'll pop this bonnet down So you got your bonnet scoop there. Uh, no stone chips along the front of here, which is good. Coming down the side of the vehicle now. Uh, ignoring the GXL badges, obviously it's not a GXL. A little bit of a mark up here, just by the badge. Been touched up previously. Here. Driver's door looking quite good. Sorry, passenger side door. So we've got these tool boxes on the side here. A little bit of carpet in the bottom of them.
Again, plenty of tread on the tyres back here too. Here you'll notice, so you've got two spare wheels, for starters. Um, Anderson pl plug cable tied up here for the moment. Um, actually plugs into this box. And then if I open the box up from the other side, um, there's actually a power outlet in there as well. We've got the steel tray here. So the back of the vehicle. So you got your tow bar here. And you'll notice two more power outlets back here as well as your trailer plug connector. Let's see if I can pop this on. So it's on gas struts, you get a little bit of shelving in here as well. Really, really good quality toolbox. And then you can see that's where your power actually comes through into a 12 volt power outlet, cigarette lighter style. So yeah, that's the 2010 Land Cruiser Workmate 79 series that we have here at Adelaide Vehicle Centre. I hope that gives you a better idea of the condition of our vehicle. Overall presents really, really well for a 290,000k car. Yeah, hope that helps. Thank you.